Good morning, evening, afternoon, night, ladies and gents, and welcome back to another adventure with Sarge and Bezek as we continue our journey with Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Last time we made it to, was it Twilight Village or something? And there's a curse that randomly turns people into pigs. We must investigate, get to the cause of this before someone gets eaten for dinner. I haven't been able to buy food for my children since my husband turned into a pig. Now they're all so hungry. What should I do? My oh. Crud. Kind traveler. If you have some spare food, could you share it with us? Uh, let's go hot dog. Oh, thank you so much. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. You've made my children very happy, and me as well. It's not much, but please, take this as thanks. A shooting star? Drop shooting stars on all enemies. Oh, that is good. Oh, and kind traveler, where do you hail? Oh! Hey, fix my mommy! Oh. Why? Oh, in this village, the moon is really all we can rely on. It can even grant wishes. Don't let me turn into a pig. Oh, I'll even give up bacon. Well, I hope you would have given up bacon. I've been thinking lately. If I'm going to turn into a pig, I want to be a big one. Because what's the point in being a pig, uh, pipsqueak pig, right? Gotta embrace the pickiness. Oh, crud. Oh, a customer. I'm sorry. I'm not open right now. Huh? Why am I crying? My husband's been turned into a pig. A pig! My husband went to the woods yesterday to collect herbs. But no husband came home. Instead, a pig returned. This pig! We got into a fight before he left. And I had called him a... Chauvinist, chauvinist pig. Now oh, he's really a pig. But he has a sweet side too. I cook him my favorite. What in the world's going on? So much wonderful. Uh, I'm sorry about this. I don't know why it's. I could really do without him. Oh, I think it's just supposed to be doing that. Sorry, if you want to read this stuff, go ahead and watch this in slow mo to pause. So, um, are you even listening? So, hey. Could you figure out some way to restore my husband to normal? I'll do whatever I can to help. You could even take whatever you want from the storeroom if it might help, you know. What's that? The storeroom's locked? My husband must have taken the key with him and lost it in the woods. Oh, crud. This is just not good. We need to do something for these people. Why does this person have a pipe in their house. The pipe rejected me. What do you mean it rejected me? This is Mario! The best plumber in Mushroom Kingdom! A nasty monster lives in the woods past here. I'm serious. That's what somebody said. If you still want to go through, even after hearing that, you need the mayor's permission. Oh man, the old monster beyond the town gate thing? Isn't that kind of cliched? You gotta be kidding me. Fine, let's go ask. Okay. Well, let's also get you. Oh, the bell rang, Mario. That means someone's gonna... Whew. At least it's not me this time. I'm gonna bet it's the mayor. This bell must not have been raining for long. Because it's run, what, three times now since we arrived? Hey, you don't think this pig is the mayor, do you? What do we do now, huh? We can't get his permission to pass through the gate. We could always say we got the permission before he turned into a pig. It's interesting that the pigs are 3D. Ah, crud.
Huh? The gatekeeper's gone. No, not gone. He turned into a pig. Well, not to be insensitive, but that works out for us. We can just cruise through. How about we close the gate? Oh, come on. We should close the gate on our way out. That way the piggies don't get into any trouble. Um, can you do something? Because you can see that there's... Nope. Oh wait, I'll just make you a land. What about you? Nope. Alright. Alright, hit the trees, hit the trees. It's been a while since we've had trees available. Oh. That Goomba seems a little different. There's something... Tattle Hyper Goomba. Ah, that's a Hyper Goomba, which means, um, it's a hyperactive Goomba. Duh. Max HP is 8. Okay. But this guy goes bizarre and charges up, his attack power will be 8 next turn. So better wipe it out between the time it charges up and the time it attacks. If you can't beat him, then run away, okay? Yeah, not happening. I did 6 damage, which isn't bad. A little late on that. No! Oh. Okay, let's tattle on the Hyper Paragoomba. Alright. That's a Hyper Paragoomba. It's basically just a Hyper Goomba with wings. Okay. Charging up, you'll be dealing with... Okay. Once you jump on it, it'll lose its wings and turn into a regular Hyper Goomba. Not that that's all that cool, even though no normal Hyper Goombas are dangerous. No, multi bounce. There we go. Whew, seven damage with the guard. Oh, the flower ran away. There we go. Easy enough. Only two? Come on. It's a brand new betty. Got the mushroom. All oh, right, right, tree. Nope. Not like there's really anything in the tree. Oh, super mushroom. Somebody tell me, what did I hit? Alright, jump. Multi-bounce. There we go. Let's see. Ah. It's okay, though. All they have to do is attack. Oh, the powering up. I don't blame them. That's what I would do, too, in that situation. Good, she's healing. He did. Now, the question is, are we actually killing them? Or are we just knocking them out? That is a good question. Let me know your thoughts. Hmm. Only three. Why so little? I want to be able to level up. I want to get more badge points. Super mushroom, okay.
There we go, we struck first. These guys need the hammer! Okay, so it's... Oh, what the? Oh, we lost customers or audience members. Hyper Spiky Goomba. Okay, they're all just the same thing. They just have Hyper in the name. Okay, uh, it's a Hyper Goomba with Spike on its head. Okay. To charging up its attack power at level 9. Ooh. Beat it before it attacks or you'll be in peril before you know it. Seriously. Only this book listed a way to dodge that attack. And they're probably gonna power up. Yep. Both of them do it. Ugh. Okay. Super hammer. Strike an enemy, knocking it into all enemies' position behind it. I mean, that's pretty good. Hey, our audience is already low enough. Did you have to scare them away? Let's do a power smash. Oh, one off. <coughs> oh, oh, that's good. That's good. Swap, it's going to have to be Coops. Sheesh, didn't... How am I getting these super guards? I didn't think I was that good. Alright, now just a normal attack. Good, good, good. Come on, I wanted to get on top of that thing. Let's get. Oh, there's a piggy! There we go! Shop key! Alright, we're going all the way back, people. Let's go, come on. Oh, so boring. Maybe it'll be something that allows us to move big, heavy objects. Okay, hopefully we can uh, pay the guy back for anything afterwards. Okay, what's this? Jam and jelly? Ooh, 50 flower power? Life mushroom? All right. Oh, that's something really good. Booze sheet makes party member invisible or against attacks, okay. Defense plus badge, boost Mars defense by one. Ooh, how much, how much does that cost? Five. Wow. There we go. Hold up. Hey, who's there? I just heard a voice. Oh, no, not again. It's been a while, ladies and gents, but we're about to be tricked again. There's no way that people could be here. Seriously, that's just so unlikely. Huh? What's that you say? You've seen a chest like this before? Get out of here. No, no, no. I'm not like those chests. I promise. Look at my eyes. Tell me I'm lying. Buddy, you don't got eyes. I'm not. Seriously. Just get me out of here. You'll see. Don't make me beg. 
What? Come on, you know how ridiculous you sound right now. I'm laughing in here. All right, Mario, let's also remember that every quote-unquote curse these guys have given us have actually been good. You honestly think I'm going to curse you when I get out? Curse you? Well, I did plan on doing something to you, but it's not so much as a curse as a... Well, a really wonderful new ability that will allow you to go special places. That's what I'm talking about. Doesn't that sound nice? Oh, come on. Please, just find this key and open the chest, okay? I know it's near this town somewhere. I just can't go look for it myself, because I'm in here. So, pretty, pretty, please? Crud. Crud, crud, crud. Oh, I can talk to the crow? Caw, caw, caw? Okay. Is it more caw, caw, caws? Yep. Hmm. Ooh, star piece. That's nice. Yes, I'm a novelist, and I read several books a day now. Not all pop-up books, either. I wonder if pigs can read. I'm a bit concerned about it, to be honest. Well, I don't blame you. Can't believe I didn't think of checking, you know, uh, moving closer to the camera. Or would it be the stage? I just forgotten about it because it's not utilized all the time. And we're getting star pieces. That's good. Weird how the pumpkins are 3D. Just saying. Hmm. Okay, so I gotta find this key. I struck first. Multi bounce. Uh, no, no. Let's do maybe a power bounce. Let's do power shit. Oh, yeah. <coughs> There we go. I don't think he dropped the thing. Yeah, and I could have gotten away with just a regular bounce. It didn't have to be a power bounce. Three. Hey, audience is back up to 61, so that's something. Oh, we got it. Last stand P badge. Oh, I didn't get it. Okay, all right. We need... Three... Why is he so weak?
This is the guy we gotta worry about. Oh, are we gonna get it? Are we gonna get it? Oh, we got it! Bingo! Star power is full. It was already full. Oh, we got a full house of 100 people. And we're getting some healing. That's good for Mario. Flower power up, I think. Yeah. Yes, I wonder if we'll keep at least, you know, most of the people. And I mean most, I mean more than the 61 we had before. Enemy. Now let's try a super hammer. Oh, it did not do that much to those behind. I mean, it did something. Nope. Yeah, let's be honest, it will always hurt if you get hit by him. Oh. Mm. And I speak from experience, I have been hit with a hammer. Once was by accident. I can't say the same about the others. Good, more flower power. That's what we need. Didn't even need to get the full thing. Oh, we were only at 71. Why didn't I check earlier? Why do we lose so many audience members? Star piece. supposed to do ladies and gents am I just not thinking straight will you do anything with nope it does nothing to the pigs they are invulnerable to her breath Okay, I need you to go. Is 
This is Twilight Trail. Looks like some seriously spooky woods over there. I right, some of the villagers go there to collect herbs. That's totally reckless. I never go someplace like that on my own. Not for a million coins. As big as Twilight Air, the shock of being cursed made him lose his way. I bet. Can I jump on top of the pig? It does not want me to jump on top of the pig. Come on, Goombella, let me... Nope. Looks like the key for the black chest. Maybe... We... Oh, let's look for the key to the black chest. Maybe we should search that hut outside of town. Okay, did I miss it? Am I just blind? Well, let's... I, I paid good money to be able to see... So if I'm blind, if I'm still blind, I need to get a refund. Maybe. Really? Oh, I feel stupid now. Oh. Go ahead and laugh. Go ahead and laugh. Why did I not think of just pushing against the rock? I don't know, maybe because the rock is bigger than Mario? By a lot? Oh, thank goodness, you're going to let me out? Oh, happy day! Wee <laughs> Fools! What were you expecting? Did you think a lovely lady would pop out or something? No. Now I'm going to hit you with the king of curses. The cursiest curse ever. <laughs> Fear my terrible power. You will know the pain of having your body roll up real small. Be cursed. <laughs> Now you're cursed, loser! Savor your suffering! When this curse strikes you, you won't even be able to walk. You'll be forced to roll around as a tacky tube. <laughs> your suffering amuses me, and so I laugh. Now show me your cursed plight, so I can laugh all the more. Just press and hold ZR, then rotate left repeatedly. Oh, okay. <laughs> your pathetic misery thrills me to the core. When you're in that form, you must roll everywhere like some embarrassingly extruded wheel. I want to get a good long look at you in this pitiful form. Now roll. Roll like a dropped butterscotch on a side sidewalk. <laughs> well, do you see how pitiful and tubular you are? When the suffering becomes too much, press B to revert to your normal self. Don't forget. Well, it's nice of you to tell me how to get back to normal. So tell me, do you now understand your eternal cylindrical agony? Yes. I leave you to suffer, fools. <laughs> Okay, ladies and gents, he opened the storeroom, I see. Feel free to take whatever you want out of there. That's a good trade for a chance to get my husband back, I think. No sense in fretting, though. I should get the storeroom ready for business. I sir, sure wish I had my husband back in normal form to help me run the... <coughs> run the place, you know? 
It's just the same stuff, okay. All right, ladies and gents, I'm gonna end. Oh wait, wait, we got mail. We got mail. Rogue port today. At noon today, the Excess Express ran late for the first time in ten years, as a suspicious incident activated station security measures. Area youth and huge train enthusiast Lackey was found taking pictures on in an employee-only area near the Express and was gang tackled by local Samaritans. I understand how much people are into trains, but we've got safety and security measures to uphold, blustered the train engineer. The use, uh, the youth was released with just a warning. This time. Well, hopefully he has learned his lesson. Shop reporter go. This week we highlight Glitzville souvenir shop. Though they've never attracted as many customers as the nearby hot dog stand, the proprietor is certain that any day now people will f will in fact notice that his shop exists. Early on in our interview, the owner of the nearby hot dog stand cornered our reporter and had this to say. The souvenir shop is irrelevant to true hot dog connoisseur. With ten coins to spend, a minor scuffle broke out shortly thereafter, but we're happy to report that no one was seriously injured. Apparently, everyone in Glitzville knows how to roll with a punch. Cooking for rookies. Hey there, rookies. Flex your bendy straws because today's recipe is for fresh juice. Just blend honey syrup until you reach a nice frothy texture and enjoy. Try one in the morning to start your day off right. All right. Well, ladies and gents, I'm going to end this episode here. We did get as much done as, as I was hoping, but we did get some things done. We are slowly advancing. If you like this content, make sure to leave a like, a rumble, a fiery thing, us something to let myself and others know this content is enjoyed. Make sure to leave comments in the comment section below. The good, the bad, the ugly. I can take the criticism. And last but not least, if you want to stay up to date on all the Paper Mario, Thousand Year Door, or whatever else you might be playing, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Until next time, stay safe.